Hey, I'm Isil Khan and in this video, we'll be learning about the tape correction for tension or pull. As you can see, we always pull the tape by hand or sometimes by machine while taking measurements of course. So if the pull applied to the tape in the field is different from the pull at which the tape is made, then the pull or tension correction to the measure length must be applied, which can be CP equals P minus P naught times L divided by AE, where P equals the pull applied during the measurement, or you can say the force applied while taking measurements or making measurements. P naught is the standard pull at which the tape can be manufactured or made. A is the gross cross-sectional area of the tape, which can be in square centimeters, okay, if you are working in MK system. E is the young modulus or you can say modulus of the elasticity of the tape material okay and L equals the measure length which can be in meters all right let's say we measure 2306.34 meters distance by a steel tape made at 7 kg tensile force the pull applied to the tape was noted as 10 kg in the field and we are asked to work out the correct distance if the cross-sectional area of the tape is 0.08 square centimeters. Let's say the modulus of elasticity of the tape material is 21 times 10 raised to power 5 kg per square centimeter. As you can see, the pull applied to the tape material on the uh, field, you can say, is different from the pull at which the tape was made. So that's why we need to calculate the pull or tension correction first, which is given as CP equals P minus P naught times L divided by AE. So the only thing we need to do here is to put values in the formula, like CP equals P, which is given, okay, that's 10 kg, minus P naught, which is of course 7 kg, times L, and that is given, okay, the measured distance, you can say, that is 2306.34, you can say, divided by A, that is the gross cross-sectional area of the tape, okay, and that is 0.08 times modulus of elasticity of the tape material which is 21 times 10 power 5 kg per square centimeter. So just do little mathematics with this guy. We can get of course CP equals 0.0412 meter. Okay, that is just the correction to the pull or tension. Now the correct length is going to be, or you can say the correct distance is going to be the measured length which is 2306.34 plus the pull correction which is of course 0 0.0412 so the correct distance is now 2306.3812 meters and that's it this is how we can calculate the pull or tension correction okay hey if you like these types of videos please hit that subscribe button press the bell icon and never miss an update from engineer boy Thank you dears for watching, see you next time, hello salam.